Oh, that must be. Yep, it is. Love that dude. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Noisy Boy here and welcome back to the channel. In today's Near 2 video we're going to be continuing on with the main mission called Pervading Waters. But before we get started guys, remember, if you have been enjoying this series so far, remember to smash the like button because it really helps out the channel. And if you're new, feel free to subscribe because I'd love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comments section below. Now I recognize this armor and that rifle from anywhere. This is Saika Magoichi. I love this guy, he was one of my favourites in Neo 1. Just love the way he looks and the fact that he uses like a katana and a uh, a weapon at the same time, a, a rifle. Off camera I actually upgraded this to level 73. Um, it was currently 64 I think it was. I just wanted that extra power just so I could do it and I think I upgraded that as well because that was... and that as well because they were both 57 I think so... as you can see I'm rate of sensor and all that kind of stuff so... Anyway guys, without further ado, let's uh, see how this goes and uh, let's rock and roll. Yeah, I know who that is. That's Saika. Love that guy. Look at him. What a badass. Obviously looked a little bit different. And that's the no uh, the Nobunaga that we know. So I feel as if things are going to go really wrong. Oh, that's a badass guardian spirit too. I think he had good intentions to unite the country, but just some of his methods, if you don't know who he is in history, would be pretty questionable, um, to say the least anyway, so some would call it barbaric, some would call it merciful, but I guess there have been worse tyrants than him in history. Oh, so we get his spirit straight away. Now you can see we get into the cusp where when we played Neo 1 we were introduced to Nobunaga when he looked like that. Oh, nice. It's so also a pretty cool little uh, guided spirit, I guess. As you can see, my guy looks a little bit different than normal. If you're just tuning in now. Now, I think... Memory serves me right, I struggled against Psycho when I first fought him in Neo 1, just having that, um... Having that, um, balance of katana and rifle was actually quite cool. Um, obviously does look a bit younger in this one, but... We'll go up and get this. I'm guessing that door there is locked and you gotta open it from the other side. Yep. So usually around about now you should be trying to actually round out your build. Oh, there's another door right there. You should be trying to round out your build about now. I'm guessing this is around about the halfway mark. Or maybe just a bit later. Oh, 
to that. But you know, trying to just get that build not you know done and dusted, but oh fuck. Ah. Yeah, but just trying to actually Oh shit, you little prick. And I love it how they have pistols and rifles and shit, it's so cool. It's like the the Japanese cowboy. But I mean you should be trying to round out your stuff like trying to unlock a few of your things. I know a lot of the um <coughs> special abilities are probably still locked off, but um, you know, you should have like, depending on what kind of build, if you're going for like a ninjutsu build, you should have the majority of what you need and shit like that, and same with, oh, oh fuck, little bastard, same with Omnio builds or, you know, weapons and all that kind of stuff, you should have the majority of your stuff. Getting into the part where this game should start getting a lot more intense and going more towards the end game type shit, so... And again, I wanted to address the length of these videos. I know they'll be longer, and I think I released one <coughs> the other week where it was like just under an hour long now. Of course, I can't. Uh, oh, you lucky you stopped. I reckon that would have whizzed right past his head. Oh, come on, stop walking. He's got to stop on the tree, isn't he? Yep. Oh, God, I'm nice. I think they went through the branches. Um, so yeah, I'm just, like I said before, I'm trying my best to try and get these these down, but because they are blind, I'm not quite sure which way to go, and blah blah blah, and me being uh, a bit OCD, I want to get all the, the items and all the loot. I think I'm tracking pretty well in this game, like I think my, you know, like if I went through the game again, I could probably half the amount of time, but, oh well, I was just, you know, I think like I said in a... Uh, when I did Neo 1, it was so stressful going through it, well actually the first time going through it wasn't that hard at all, but it was the second time going through it, it was stressful for me because, you know, you know where to go, you know what to do, but I changed the build around, so it was, what the hell? Huh. Sneaky bastard. Alright, let's go hostile. Maybe a backflip. Hell yeah. You know, maybe you'll, you know, some will be longer, some of them won't be, but like I said before, I'm trying to get them to 25 to 30 minutes, so. So, pretty much what I'm trying to say is that I can't guarantee a 30 minute video every time. If it's a short mi mission, like a. Oh, there's a Kadam right there, like a uh, sub mission or something like that, then yeah, I don't mind, but. I think the other day I put three missions in one, and it ended up being like a little over 30 minutes, so. But I find these main missions, especially with the Kodamas, because you have to check every little little crook and nanny and all that kind of shit, and it's just one of those things. You can't really help it. Excuse me if you can hear that, but there's a truck just outside. Um... Oh, you bastard. Damn it. Yeah, so there are a few Kadamas. I'm gonna s have faith that it will lead my <laughs> me around, but... Oh, you fucking bastard. Take that. One of the other things is that I know that other players have, like, already done, like, you know, four, five, six, ten builds already, whereas I haven't even finished the main story yet, and with the DLCs coming out really soon as well, I'm probably not going to have enough time, but we'll see how we go, because even in Neo 1, I didn't even do any of the um, DLCs in Neo 1, I think they released three, I didn't even do one of them, so, I know, I just got to the point of that game where I just, I was happy with the game, I liked it, but I didn't want to play it anymore, 
Because it was such a slog and grind for me, to be honest. This one, probably not so much. Oh shit. I'm pretty much fighting this just the same as the other one, but I'm a bit more wiser this time around. Oh fuck, did I just... How do I get around? Is there a back path that I'm missing? I must have walked straight past something. Oh, it must be here. Ah, oh, yeah, okay, there's a bridge. And I was up on that roof. Oh shit. Is that one of those elites? I think it is. I uh, might be able to get up in behind her. Might be able to jump off this roof. See how we go. Because before I just plunge straight down, I might be able to get in around her. I could shoot from here, but if she is an elite. Oh wait, there's an item in that drop off. That's shiny. Just want to make sure that I can actually get around to that Kodama, because there's one just around there. Or maybe not, maybe I have to go around. Yeah, I think I do. Wait, is this the right way? Oh, and I've come here. That's where I first saw the Kadama. Okay, I know where I am. No way to get over there. That's all blocked off by purpose, I guess. That's where I killed the guy. Can I jump off this side, maybe? No, there's all those fences there, too, so it looks like I am going to have to go. Uh, what I might do... No, that's all fenced off too. Damn it. Uh, what I might do is jump in through there, see if I can get in behind her this way. I think it's an enemy. Yeah, I thought so. Wouldn't be that easy. It's like there's a gate there too. Wonder if I oh there's a nice. So I wonder if I can kill her from here. Wait, that is an elite, isn't it? If I, can, oh, I should have done it earlier. Damn it. <laughs> Not today, girl. Got him. 
and that's where I was before. Alright, so that kind of worked out a bit easier than I thought. Still no way around, I guess not. Well, looks like we're going to have to come up through there and go down there. Let's make our way around. Oh shit, is that an item? I think it is. Oh, this too. Oh, looks like he needs help. Can't go up a level. Uh, we'll try and get the heart to at least 50. And I might start after I've gotten to 50. I'll see how we go. Might try and get Constitution to 14. <laughs> Yeah, that looks like a dark run back there. The fuck is that? Is that a one of those blob things? <coughs> Where are my bombs at? Shit, where are my bombs at? This is a shrapnel bomb in there, is. <coughs> oh fuck, oh, it's a fucking snake. Oh, you little bitch. Come on, then. like in a slow motion bitch. Jeez, I remember they used to give me so much trouble. There you are. Finally. I guess we can continue on. Um, bit of a pain in the ass, Dark Realm. The hell is that? Oh, it's got a. What the fuck is that? I don't know if that thing is the host of the dark room, but if that lantern is just sitting there, then it's got to be destroyed. So I'll try and probably take that out first. I can spread myself out a little bit. Alright, let's go. Oh, wrong one, fuck. Oh, fuck, get out of the way. Oh shit. Oh my gosh, it releases those things. Holy fuck. Oh, and it was the host too, nice. Yeah. Have to take that cannon dude out. I didn't even realize that that was the host. Son of a bitch. Asshole, see how much lightning damage I was doing there. Oh fuck, what the hell is that? You fat bastard. Oh! With the drop kick. Your 
fat ass down here. Look how much slow he is. Well, that was a bit of luck there, I think. Holy hell, oh, how did she not see me? Oh, is it gone? The distance too. This area may be clear. Might be a gaki kicking around, but I think we're pretty sweet. Seen the chest, I knew that was coming. Ninja locks, nice. I had no idea that those lanterns were the hosts. I think that's probably clear. As I make our way up to the top. Not sure about that, but okay. Alright, the zero. There is two, nice. Oh, I hate fart rats, damn it. Oh, I hate these assholes. Oh shit, I sent it right off the edge. Not today, son. Gakis. Fucking skeletons. I feel as if I've gone through a fair bit of this level. Done a fair bit, picked up a fair bit as well, but we will continue on. So there's a drop off there. Kick down. Where does that go? It goes to something, but not 100% sure what. There was one of those little baby lickers at the bottom. Okay, so let's continue on to the next house. Hut or whatever it is. Shit. I'm gonna run away from me this time. Bit in these yet either. Um, quick change. Hell yeah, finally got quick change. I 
and for those of you who are new to this I guess quick change is just when your health reaches zero you actually come back and get another another life so it's always handy oh scamps alright asshole this must lead back around to the front Oh, is that that bridge? I think it is. Oh, maybe not. There's a pathway on here, but where does it go? Oh, it does lead around to the other side. Sorry. This is after we fought that elite girl. Nice. Right, all the better for it, so that was just like a major shortcut. So you had to have kicked that ladder down anyway, so... So it just skips all of that bullshit. Oh, he's got a cannon. Ugh. Oh, there's an item up there too, hmm. Oh fuck. Get your ass off that ledge. Didn't even see him. So I gotta drop off from there. Go across and jump off, yeah. All there for some wood. All right, let's continue. Uh, how do we have time? Oof, getting there. I feel as if we should just keep continuing on because there's no real. I uh, no sure sign that I should stop. Snake lady on a gaki. Wow, look out. Get off. Well, he shouldn't climb up. Maybe I can plunge on the uh, snake girl. Wherever she's gone. There she is. Got you, bitch. Nice. Fuck with me, bitch. Ain't going nowhere. Oh, shit. Let's get the shit out of me. Get your ass out of there too. Oh, and there is a Kodama. Very nice. I feel as if we've found a fair few of them already. I've lost count, but I'm not sure if that's four or five, but uh, we'll come back to that, I think. Just see what's down in this area first. Yeah, I feel as if I've gotten four or five of them. Yeah, pretty relatively easy too. I came from. Let's go this way again. There should be a path going inside. Right there. So let's see what we got inside this little hut. 
nice little house, I guess you could call it. Oh no, it's one of those girls. Fuck! I remember fighting her in the demo. Fuck, she was hard. And even in a previous submission. Fuck, okay, so... Okay, so she is significantly slowed down too. Oh wow, okay, so that went a bit different. I thought that was going to be super hard. I guess the headshot... Uh, she was like holding a stone or something? Damn, that's noisy. Um, somehow I've got to get down there. So there must be just a drop off or a way out. Uh, drop off right there. Um... <coughs> Looks like there's a good damage down there somewhere. I'll just go back around, make sure we don't miss anything on this side. Must be fighting right under me. Right, let's go. Gotta get that item somehow to. Oh fuck! I wasn't supposed to do that. I swear we have like, can't even remember what, uh, how do I get back up there? Um, okay, so... Okay, so we're back to, okay, so we're back to here now. This is right at the beginning of the game, I see, okay. Let's just try and grab that item first before we continue on. Okay, looks like there's a way down there too. It looks like there's a Kadama down there as well. Oh, well fuck it, we'll just fucking rest now. Uh, yeah, yeah, fuck, we'll just rest now. Never know what I could run into. Just so we're ready to go as well. Okay, so that's how you get back up. Guess we try and drop down here. Oh, fuck shit. God damn it. Nice. one up and I guess we're gonna have to help old mate out. Oh, and there's actually been something I've been meaning to talk about too actually. I'll, we'll take this guy out then I'll chat about it in a sec. Um, this shouldn't be too hard. I can't underestimate them. Let's rock and roll. What up dude? Oh, look at that damage. Beautiful damage. Nice. Okay, so what I wanted to talk to you guys about is this guy. Um, was, I can't remember which one. I think it was like Yokai Hunt. I think that's what the quest we are. We was talking about going through the quest twice. I'd only record myself going through it once because I'd already done it twice before that. Now, the only reason why I was talking about that is because if you don't end up doing it twice, you can't actually use this guy. If you talk to him enough, then he starts to come with you just like that. Now, that was actually spoiled to me from one of my mates, but it was actually a good spoil because I would have never had known that. Not at all. Anyway, just so you know, you have to... I think it's called Yokai Han. I can't remember off the top of my head, but... Um, and I did mention it. I can't remember which video it was, but I think it was a side mission where you get to pick who you can run with, and I picked both of them, so was uh, old Aquaman and um, that dude. I can't remember his name, it's like Kaibudu or some shit. Take that. Uh. 
So you just uh, thought you guys would want to know. I think it's like an achievement you can get. So anyway, if you don't do it twice with him, whether it's the first or second time with this guy, you don't get to use him, so... And it makes... I guess it's going to have to make this a lot easier. Okay, so there is a Kodama down there. Looks like there's two guys at the far distance there. Just up there. Might be able to slot them from here. And that Kodama is like really close. Actually, looks like he's just down there. Get this guy first. Oh, there's a guy just up there too. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, he's coming. Come on then, son. Ah, oh, damn it. He's like, who shot me? I did. Pick up that. Hey, sneaky bastard, look at that. Looks like there's one of those blobs in the water, you sneaky bastard. Oh, hold on, no, it's wrong. Oh, I thought that was a blob. Oh well. Uh, I guess we're going to go around. Looks like there's a way down there too, so let's go around. Pick up this called Dama. There he is. I would imagine that would be a hard one to get. Well, not a hard one, but... You wouldn't expect one to be there. Oh, they look like there was a item down here. Oh, you sneaky bastards. Now that is definitely one of those blob dudes if you have a look again. You can see, yeah, yeah see, look at that. You sneaky bastards. Do I have any, yeah, do bombs on me? Let's hit up and around. Be careful we don't fall off the edge. Take that. Mm. All that for sacred water and some noble dung ball. And a leather cord. Totally worth it. Can't go that way. Alright, let's go back and go up those stairs. So far, so good. Don't think I've died yet. <laughs> Touch wood. Is there another shortcut through here? Nice. So this would have been back to where we picked up old mate. Yes, nice. Through there, that's where we fought the old big mate and uh, old side guy. Anything else around? Oh, there's a guy on that bridge. Oh, fart rat. God damn it, I hate those bastards. They move so quick. Yeah, that was me. Come on, dude, really? Yeah, he's just like, fuck that dude. Oh. Right into my hands. Tesso cool, nice. Tesso. Looks like there might be a way up and around. Looks like there's a Kadama down there too. Oh, you sneaky bastard. Oh, 
Take that, you ass hat. Alright, now that we've used up all the rifle ammo, we'll switch up to the bedrock. And I like to do that while I'm playing the games, like I keep the arrow or the bow on and I try to swap in between, um, you know, the bow and the rifle, or the cannon and the rifle, I should say. Doesn't like the fire very much. Oh, I always walk straight off that edge too. <coughs> I just didn't even notice the time. 41 minutes, damn. Guess I better wrap it up pretty soon. Like, I feel like I've gone through a lot, but... Like, I haven't come up against any bosses or anything like that. So there's that one. Jeez, there can't be too many left, surely. You sneaky fuck. Dragon whistle, what was that? Hand cannon, <laughs> Okay. Pretty basic weapon to have right now. So it looks like there's another way around up there. Okay, so we'll go up this ladder first. Try to get that item up the back there and see what it is. Fucking guckies, man, I can tell you. Drop off here. What the fuck off. Get off of there. Plunge to your death. Sudama. See if you can give me, um. I keep putting down a weapon like I probably shouldn't, but like. <laughs> like it hasn't worked yet. I should probably just be like. You know. Just getting. Spirit stones and shit is probably a lot better. Brutex. Brutex. Uh, what do I want here? I'm not even sure what I want here. Uh, yeah, I might save it. I really want. Uh, not that one really want this ability. Um, there's not really much else I want. The ones that I do want are like still locked. Alright, well, I have a feeling that might be all she wrote. Uh, was there a way down there? No, there we got that already. So I think this might be this side of the place. Yeah, I think that might be done. Oh, I can see a guy in the middle. There's one on the side too. It's that dude right there. I can see that guy up in the corner too. Oof. I think I'm just outside his range. Is that? Looks like there might be a second. Go oh, damn, I've only got cannons left. Oh, I might be able to get him, though. Oh, 
Damn it. Let's come a bit close. Oh shit. Get him, dude. Oh, wrong one. Did it again. Fuck. Hold off until I get there. Nice. Take that. Finish him. Fatality. Got him, coach. Well, actually, bringing this guy, th um, bringing that dude through here has actually made it a hell of a lot easier. I gotta have to afford that guy while trying to avoid those bullets, so obviously worth it. Oh, beautiful. I think this is the perfect place to wrap it up to. Was that a... yeah, it is too. Looks like there are a couple of doors available too. Oh, look at that. I'm guessing that's the way to the boss. But it also looks like there's a way up to the right as well, which is interesting. Got the Tesso Soul Core. It looks like there might be a way up just behind me, just there, so. I don't know if it leads around maybe, but it looks like a pretty small area. Looks like there's a door to that side too. Can we open it or? No, okay, so we have to, f it's locked, so we have to find a key, so we must have to go up there anyway, so I guess that is actually part of progression. Uh, well, anyway, guys, I might just wrap it up here, 48 minutes, I apologise for that, but if you did enjoy it, guys, remember to smash the like button, because it really helps out the channel, if you're new, feel free to subscribe, because I love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comment section below. I am your steam toast, Noisy Boy, thanks for coming on by, and as always, guys, stay noisy.